Mathematics and welcome once more to your English class for fifth grade. Today is a wonderful day. Today is a great day. Remember last week we spoke about culture and tradition and we show you custom, dress, food and so forth. Well, today I'm dressed celebrating black ethnicity. Yeah, black ethnicity and dress for that celebration. May, this month is black ethnicity month. So we celebrate it, dressing, eating, dancing, where well, we cannot go nowhere, but we can dance at home. We need to protect ourselves. That's why we cannot go and dance, okay? So, Let's wash our hands. We wash our hands with soap and water. We use masks. We use a mask to cover and protect our nose and our mouth. And we avoid to touch our eyes, our nose, our mouth. Do not touch it. And if your hand is dirty, you go and you wash your hands, and then you can touch. Keep your distance. Remember, two meters of distance. Keep your distance to avoid a contain. Stay home. We need to stay home. If you don't have nothing to do in the on the street, don't go out stay at home all right we are here giving your class at virtually remember we say panama has a variety of ethnic groups a variety yes panama has a variety of ethnic groups remember we also say fish and rice are common Food in Panama, Nabe and Bogle share the same sediment, Embera and Wonam share the same sediment, Nabe and Bogle speak different languages, Embera and Wonam speak different languages. Remember that? Okay, today objective are to compare the different ethnic groups of Panama and to use superlative and comparative forms of adjective to make comparison. Mm. Interesting. So,
nouns. Remember, nouns is person, objects, remember? So we compare. For example, my house is larger than earth, or it's bigger than earth. This box is smaller than the one I lost. Your dog run faster than Jim dog. The rock flew higher than the roof. Remember, when we compare, we compare one item with another item. So it's one nun with another nun. Superlative. As you notice, okay, before we go to superlative, as you notice, we add ER. We add ER to the adjective. You notice that my O's is larger, it finished with an ER. The box is smaller, it also finished with ER. Faster and higher. So comparative adjective are at an ER to make it comparative. Let's go now to superlative. Superlative adjective is used to compare one nun with a group of nuns. One nun with a group of nuns. For example, my house is the largest one in the neighborhood. This is the smallest box I've ever seen. Your dog run faster of any dog in the race. So we compare one nun with many nuns. Notice that they finish with EST. Superlative adjective finish with EST. So largest, smallest, fastest. There are many ways to take an adjective and make it a comparison adjective or a superlative adjective. If the adjective is one syllable, for instance, small, one syllable, small, large, that's one syllable. You see it's many letters, but it's one syllable. When you pronounce, when you read it, it's one syllable. Large, tall, fat, big, sad. That's one syllable. So we want to convert that adjective to a comparative form, or to a comparative adjective. We add, remember, ER. So it will be smaller. Larger, taller, fatter, bigger, sadder. And if we want to make it superlative, we will add an EST. Remember we mentioned EST? Smallest, largest, tallest, fastest, biggest. Status. That's the way we convert an adjective to comparative or superlative. But if the word has two syllables, or we transform it, when we have two syllables, if it finish with a Y, we change the Y for an I. I E R, and it will be appear. And to convert it to superlative, you will add the I and you add E S T, so it will be happiest. Remember, if we have a I, we change it to a. If we have a Y, we change it to a I. Simple, simpler. Simplest. Busy. Same example as happy. 
You change the Y to an I. Busier. Busiest. Tilt. There are many words that instead of changing to ER or to EST, you will add the word more. We cannot say tilt the, tilt this. We cannot say that. So we add more. So it will be more tilt, more tilt, most tilt. So what we do when the syllable is three or more? We cannot add ER or EST, so we add the word more. So important as three syllables, important, three syllables. Expensive, expensive. We add the word more, more important more expensive, most important, most expensive. That's the way we will modify or convert a three-syllable adjective to comparative or superlative. Next, we have irregular adjectives. The irregular adjectives are the ones that when they go to change the comparative form, or the superlative form, they change completely, completely. We do not add ER or EST, it change completely. For instance, good, the comparative form will be better. Mm, it will not be gooder, it will be better. And the superlative will be the best, the best. Well, the comparative form will be better and the superlative will be the best, as well as the, the previous one. Bad, bad, the comparative form will be worse, and the superlative will be the worse. Okay? That's example, those are examples of all irregular adjectives convert to superlative or comparative. It changed completely. It could be confusing, but we need to try to get accustomed to them and know when to use them. Remember we, we spoke last week that Panama has a variety of ethnic groups? Mestizo, Black, White, Native American. What's the meaning of variety? Variety means different. When we speak about variety, we speak about different different form, different kind, different. Let us use the comparative and superlative words to write sentences. Mola has, became, has become the largest part of the Guna people's economy. Largest, we're comparing the Mola with the economy. The Embela territory is smaller than the Navis territory, and we can look at the map to notice that difference. The Navis territory is the biggest territory of all. We're using biggest because we're comparing Navis territory with all the other territory. That's the reason why we use biggest. And we use smaller before because we're comparing one with another, okay? One none with another none. Bribi as the smallest territory. We are comparing Bribi territory with all the rest of territory. Good, so the poyera is the most expensive typical dress of Panama. We are comparing the poyera dress with all the rest of typical dress in Panama. The Panama Canal is the most important asset of Panama. There we are also comparing the Panama Canal with all the other assets of Panama. The Baru Volcano is the tallest mountain in Panama. 
We use tallest because we are comparing that mountain with all the other mountains. Good. For homework, I will I need you, I would like you to create sentences with comparative and superlative adjective. Write those sentences, make the comparison and send it to me. And let's discuss it next week. So that will be all for today. Remember, your own work, you can send it to my email address and you can send it to my Instagram and also follow me. But before we go, we need to remember to give a special thanks to Ms. Daida Grayton, she's our academic coordinator. And we cannot forget our sponsors, the companies that support this program and make it possible. So, it's time to say goodbye, see you later, see you later alligator, have a nice weekend. Bye-bye, see you next week. <laughs>